Are you preparing for NEET? Confused about how important NCERT is? You're not alone. Many students debate its significance in the NEET exam. Some say it's crucial for success while others believe it is overrated. Now the only way to find out the real truth is to look for concrete evidence and that is what I did. So I conducted an in-depth analysis of this year's NEET chemistry paper to find out the real source of every single question and guess what? The results shocked me. Now stay with me till the very end of this video to find out the truth about NCERT. Now look at this question here. Now this question in the NEET 2024, a compound is formed by two elements A and B. This question is from solid state and this, if you compare it with this question of NCRT solid state in text question 1.16, you'll find the same subjective question has been converted into objective question directly from NCRT. Next, let us look at this question here from S block. The question reason metallic sodium dissolves in liquid ammonia giving a deep blue solution. Now this is directly from one single paragraph of NCRT class 11. S block. Entire question you'll find this single paragraph. Another beautiful question from Practical Organic Chemistry. Lesson extract of an organic compound, both nitrogen and sulfur are present, which give blood red color with Fe3 positive ion due to the formation of. The entire question is from this particular topic, 12.9.2 NCRT class 11th, the first chapter of Organic Chemistry. Now this beautiful question from Electrochemistry. If you look at the question, the everything, the structure of the question perfectly matches with the exercise question 3.9 in the NCRT Electrochemistry chapter. Only the values are different, but what is given, what is asked exactly the same. So it is totally inspired from this question. So you can say directly from NCRT. Now this is one beautiful question from D&F block. The stability of copper 2 positive ion is more than copper one positive salt in echo solution due to page number 219 D and F block elements NCRT class 12th. Now look at the statement. They are perfectly mentioned. However, many copper one compounds are unstable in echo solution and undergo disproportionation like this. The stability of copper two positive echoes rather than copper one positive is due to the much more negative delta H hydration. So perfectly directly from NCRT. Now look at this beautiful question from biomolecules. Now just look at the statement. Statement one, a unit formed by the attachment of a base to one dash position of sugar is known as nucleoside. And when nucleoside is linked to phosphorus, acid at 5 dash position of sugar moiety, we get nucleotide. Now look at the NCRT. Okay, this article 14.5.2. The unit formed by the attachment of a base to 1 dash position of sugar is known as nucleoside. Perfect match. Then when nucleoside is linked to the phosphoric acid. So they just made this minor change phosphorus and here it was phosphoric. And that is why this statement 2 is wrong. So you can see how perfectly it matches with the NCRT. Now this amazing question from Arbonyl compound based on tolerance test. Now look at the stoichiometry. This organic compound plus two molecule of tolerance plus three OH negative. On heating, what is the major product? Now if you look at the tolerance test, page number 361, aldehyde ketones and carboxylic acid, RCHO, that is aldehyde, the molecule containing aldehyde group plus two molecule of tolerance plus three OH negative gives you RCO negative plus two silver. So perfectly directly from NCRT. And that's this another question. These are the following statements are incorrect directly from D and F block. So you can see all the oxidation states data here. And then article 8.4 oxides and oxo ions everything has been mentioned clearly this question from metallurgy directly from page number 155 okay this uh, blast furnace diagram where they have mentioned the reactions taking place under different different temperature ranges directly from ncrt and then this on balancing the given redox reaction this is a direct salt example direct salt example problem 8.8 directly asked in then what fraction of one edged octal voids directly from this information in the solid state chapter Everything is given one fourth of each void belongs to a particular unit cell. So now you have seen the truth with the proof that out of 50 questions, 45 questions were directly from NCRT and rest 5 questions are also related to whatever has been given in NCRT plus NCRT exemplar plus lab manual. And the PDF of this entire proof is in the description. Now there's another question that is very, very important for you, sir. Okay, now we understand, we believe that yes, the neat chemistry paper directly comes from NCRT, but sir, how to retain NCRT? We're not able to retain the information. There are so many students reading NCRT, but some of them are scoring very good and some of them are scoring very very bad. So what is the right way to read and retain NCRT information? So I'll discuss that in the next video. So stay tuned. Do like, subscribe and share this video. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye. <laughs>